The Indiana Pacers beat the Sacramento Kings 126-121 to on the road just two weeks ago. Tonight they get the rematch at home, and we're here to break it down for you from a sports betting point of view. I'll give you guys my pick, my prediction in the game. This is Steve Seagrave from SportsMemo.com. I also have a promo to share with you guys at the end of the video. But for now, if you guys could hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and let us know in the comments section who do you guys have in this game, whether it be a side, a total, a player prop. We love to hear from you guys. Let us know in the comments section and hit the bell so you don't miss any of this great content. Looking at the Wager Talk Live Odds screen, Kings three point road favorites tonight. Total set high at 248 and a half. The total makes sense considering we have these teams ranked number one and number nine in both scoring and pace of play. Indiana number one in pace of play and in scoring. Both teams coming off road losses. Kings two nights ago, 115-106 in Miami against the Heat. Pacers just lost last night in New York to the Knicks, 109-105. Quick peek at the injury report. Kings, basically a clean injury report. Nothing to report here from these guys. Pacers, uh, just Benedict Mathurin, questionable tonight with a toe injury. He missed last game. Outside of that, nothing listed, but... Tyrese Halliburton has been dealing with a hamstring injury that kept him out for a while, and he just hasn't looked the same. He's coming off a weird game, uh, an odd game for him last night, where he only scored 15 points with only five assists, really low totals for him. So he just doesn't seem to have to, to quite look right recently, and the Pacers are also on a back-to-back -back in this one. As we mentioned, the Pacers won 126 to 121 at home just two weeks ago. That game was without Halliburton, but Halliburton, like I said, he hasn't really looked to be himself recently. Last night, only 15 points and five assists. Pretty odd game for him. Pacers also one of the worst teams in the NBA in back-to-back -back situations. Only two and seven straight up in back-to-back -back so far this season, and tonight the spread only negative three for the Kings. It's basically pretty close to being just about a, a, a pick em relatively close to that and we as I said as I've mentioned a couple times now Halliburton just doesn't seem to be 100% Kings they should have some extra motivation tonight uh, both Sabonis DeMontis Sabonis and De'Aaron Fox snubbed as all-star reserves despite the Kings strong season number five seed right now in the Western Conference and that could be some motivation especially for a player like Fox who takes things personally and, uh, you know, Sabonis also, we'll mention that in a minute, but he's also playing in Indiana tonight where he's played uh, a good majority of his career before joining Sacramento. Kings also solid in uh, road ATS situations this season. One of the better records, 14-10 and 10 ATS on the road this season. So I'm, I'm leaning their way this way in this one. I like the Kings. It's going to be a high-scoring game. I, I can't quite get there with the total. But I do like the Kings laying the three points tonight with the added motivation of the all-star snubs. Sabonis playing back in Indiana. Halliburton not looking 100%. And the Pacers just haven't been good in back-to-back -back situations. A player prop that I would look at, going back to Sabonis, it's a big number. But over 43.5 points, plus rebounds, plus assists. Like I said, he's, against, he's, he's going up against his former team here. He had 42 PRAs. In that last game against him just two weeks ago. And he's been really tearing it up recently on the boards. He gets plenty of assists, points, 49 and 51. He's crushed this total in his last two games with 49 and 51 PRA. So I'd also look towards the bonus on a PRA over tonight. I got a promo to tell you guys about a really good one. It's the Super Bowl, the Super Bowl promo. You get it for less than $100 a month. Includes all sports, all plays, 5% plays, every sport that we have over at Wager Talk and Sports Memo. This package usually costs just under two grand at $19.99, discounted down to just under $1,200 at $11.99. Breaks down to only $23 a week, and that could be the cost of a 4% play. So you're getting tremendous value on this one. And if you were to get it today, you essentially get a free week. You'd get it instantly, and you, it's Super Bowl to Super Bowl. But for every day you get it before the Super Bowl, that would essentially be a free week. A little week plus, actually, if you got it today. So check out that deal. You don't need a promo code. It's Super Bowl to Super Bowl deal. Any handicapper at Wager Talk or Sports Memo. You get the whole year 
uh, discounted only only eleven ninety nine on the year. Like I said, twenty three per week. So and I'm in action tonight in the NBA and uh, Super Bowl as well. I have a Super Bowl play up. You can check that out over at my page at sportsmemo.com. And for tonight's free play, we're going to go Kings negative three. That'll be my official play tonight. Also a lean on the player prop. Let's go with Sabonis over his 43.5 PRAs. It's a big number, but a lot of motivational factors here. Should be a high pace game, a lot of scoring, and he's been in great form recently. So let us know who you guys like in the comment section. I'll see you guys next video, and good luck tonight.